there we have it that's the basic sand coat uh, that's what I've gone with um, it could be early mid or late war with the sand coat and I've done some, some excuse my hand some conversion work on the driver I've uh, show you I've uh, trimmed the rifle off and the rifle strap taken the uh, helmet head which would have marked them as um, early only the style and we put um, it's a Warlord Games porridge cap head yeah so I'm now going to get in paint I think I'm going for a basic green with this guy uh, German uh, German uniform green so I'll get stuck in and undercoat him um, and I'll also add some I think some green patches on that now and um, and maybe some brown patches as well so I'll get on come back with some brown Okay, the um, progress so far. Um, well, I finished the driver. I got kind of carried away. So I'll, uh, yeah, finished him off. <laughs> there we go. It's enjoyable to do. As I said, I took the, the rifle off his arm, forage cap. I mean, he looks in a weird sort of crouching position, but that's obviously uh, to sit on the kitten crowd. Um, I'll just fix him in place. He does sit in there quite nicely now. As you can see, I've started putting green and I've started putting brown. I've got to shade those. Um, yeah, as I say, driver's finished, obviously. Um, leather seats on the back and leather seat for him to sit on, which I think I'm going for a dark brown leather. They appear to be sort of dark brown or black leather in pictures. But, uh, right, so I'll carry on with this. Uh, brown to add, a shading on the green, shading on the brown, and then I've got to do the tracks and the tyres. So. I'll get on and do some more back soon. Right, there we have it so far. This basic uh, camo I've gone for sand, brown, and green. Uh, the other side, seats in a dark brown, leather brown, um, single motorcycle seat, and the back seat. Yeah, uh, tracks are just in a, a metallic chainmail y, whatever effect. Right, so I'm going to um, I put a wash on there. I think they've had the flesh, yeah, flesh wash. I'm going to add a bit of shading now to brighten them up a bit. And then I've got weapons to put on the back seat. Uh, what have I got? Panzerfaust, um, MP40, and what I've got? Some helmet and packs and, and grenades, whatever else. So, right, I'm going to get it all sorted, dry brushed, uh, fitted up, and I think I'll come back for a final round up when it's all done. So back soon. And there we have it, just about finished. Um, still a bit shiny, just done all the shading. So we've got shading on all the various colours. Rider has finished. Um, I put a load of stowage equipment on the back. We've got a helmet, backpack, a couple of pans of Faust, and an MP40. Uh, just turn him around. And you can see the other side, yep. Yeah. Uh, again shaded so all I've got to do now is um, add a matte varnish so I'll get cracking on that and then come back for a, uh, a final roundup back soon and just like that it was finished um, there we go yeah, I've done this in a mid to late war um, put some stowage in the back which I'm just going to make sure you can see that MP40, a couple of Panzerfaust, a pack, a helmet, and the rider is a conversion. Um, as you've seen earlier, uh, took the rifle off um, and put a different head on. I think it's turned out okay. I'm well pleased with it. So, yeah, there we go. Um, all I need to do now is to buy some more huh? and uh, add to the collection. That's all, thanks for looking and uh, bye for now.